I've been gone for five months now. Um, I went to France, northern France, in a city called Lille, and I was playing professional volleyball, enjoying traveling and competing and living out my dream. So I just got back a few days ago, and um, it's great to see Boulder and everyone back here and to kind of share my experiences. So it's kind of cool because when people ask me, oh, you know, you just graduated, what are you doing? And I'm like, I guess I'm technically a professional volleyball player, which is pretty exciting and kind of cool to say. I've never been out of the U.S. and um, it's a great experience to travel and see the world and learn about yourself, meet new people from all over the world and kind of connect with people that you, with different cultures and it's kind of, it's crazy. I'm from California, but leaving California wasn't so big and coming to Colorado, like it's a two hour plane ride that's driving from San Diego to LA basically. So being away from the US and away from what I was so used to for four and a half years, almost five years, was kind of tough. Um, different cultures, different people, um, was hard to get used to at first, but I, you know, I liked it. I enjoyed the challenge of trying to trying to communicate and uh, get along with people and kind of see how they live. Coming back to Boulder, this, this campus is beautiful and I was lucky to come back with like four days of just straight sunshine, no clouds in the sky and just seeing the flat irons and I'm walking to workouts at 8 in the morning because my time change is all messed up. I'm waking up at 6.30 and it's beautiful, it's breathtaking and um, yeah, I, I don't know if I took advantage of it but I mean a little bit. I live right there and the flat irons are there and it's just mind blowing. And it's great to see coming back and speaking with Rick George and all the different renovations he's doing to Dow Ward. It just kind of gives me the chills. Like it's, it's amazing that um, we have this opportunity to just extend our, our athletic facilities and academic facilities. And I wouldn't change anything from my college career or the experience I've had, the, the changes in the program, some of the hardships, you know, my ACL, whatever it may be, I wouldn't change any of it. And um, I had to present myself in front of the media, present myself in front of different people and represent a program and kind of sell myself in my program. And this helped me in the real world, especially playing volleyball, but outside of that for when I get a job in wherever it may be. I will always have t-shirts that say hey, CU Volleyball or CU Buffs and my kids, I'll make them wear, you know, CU stuff and come to the camps and stuff like that. I will always have be a buff at heart and always have a little well, um, soft spot for it. I'm working out now, I'm gonna see some family, I'm gonna go back to San Diego, but I'm picking a team for next season. I'll be heading out to another team in August. We'll see, uh, it's, it's not written yet. <laughs>